2020, I prophesy in your life that you shall be preferred above your equals in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. This year, the Lord shall favor you Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. This year, whatsoever you desire, as you are going to walk in the ways of the Lord, as you are going to make your ways right before God, God shall grant you your heart desires. Amen. Daniel made his way right before God. Daniel was preferred. He was not preferred because of his handsomeness. He was preferred because he gave himself totally unto God. He walked in the path of righteousness. And that was why the Spirit of God dwelled upon Daniel. And this year, 2021, we shall walk in the path of righteousness. Amen. So that the Spirit of God, the excellent Spirit of God, will dwell and abide in our lives. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. This evening, without waiting time, we are going into our prayer. You are going to say with me, Oh Lord, oh Lord, Lord let your excellent spirit your excellent abide spirit upon me abide upon and, me and me within me and in, the knowledge, in the knowledge, in manifestation, in, manifestation, in understanding in and wisdom throughout this year 2021 and beyond. Open your mouth and make it a prayer this night. Ask the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of God to dwell in you in wisdom. In this year 2021, you cannot do anything without the Spirit of God. Father, we call upon you, O God, that let your Spirit, O God, the excellent Spirit, dwell in us, O God, in wisdom, O God, in understanding, in your manifestation, O God, in the name of Jesus. Father, O God, we ask for wisdom upon our lives, O God, Father, for we cannot do without you this year 2021. Baba, give of glory as you walk with the Daniel, O God, we pray that you, O God, Father, will come in your fullness. Father, come, O God, King of glory, and walk, O God, Father, with us, O God, in this year, 2021, in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to say, my Father, my Father. My Father, my Father. Throughout this year, 2021, my life, my life, 
and that of my family shall stand out and shall stand tall among our companions. Let your spirit be our voice in the mighty name of Jesus. Open your mouth and make it a prayer. Ask God to come and walk with us. That God, the Spirit of God, will walk with us in our lives, in our families. Let the Spirit of God make us to stand out in the midst of others. Just as Daniel stood out in the midst of other servants. God single hand is singled him out. Open your mouth tonight and ask God to single you out in this year 2021. In the mighty name of Jesus. My Lord and my Father, oh God, we pray. Let your spirit, oh God, single us out, oh God, Father. Make us, oh God, keep our glory to stand out, oh God. Father, to stand tall, oh God, Father, in the midst of others. In righteousness, oh God. Father, we ask you, oh God, keep our glory. May your spirit, oh God, Father, single us out, oh God, this year. In the mighty name of Jesus. Turn it into a prayer. Open your mouth and pray. Have the spirit of God to single you out this year. 2021, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we call upon you, Father, oh God, our family, Father, oh God, single us out, oh God, this day, in the mighty name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray, say, my Father, my, father, my hands, my hand. I want you to lift up your hands wherever you are, say, my hands, my hand. say it again, my Father, my, father. my hands, my shall be a touch be a of wealth. And prosperity in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Just like Joseph. Joseph was prosperous. Joseph was favored. He was favored in the house of Potiphar. God singled him out. He became a talk of town, a foreigner in another country. He reigned supreme over the, 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 over the, the citizens. I want you to open your mind and pray this year that God will single you, that God will bless the works of your hand, that whatsoever you touch shall be a touch of wealth, that whatsoever you touch shall be a touch of prosperity. Open your mind and pray that this year there shall be nothing that will hinder you from moving forward. Our team says, my year of greater height. Open your mind and start to pray. Ask God to send you out that whatsoever you shall touch your hands upon will be the touch of wealth, not the touch of sorrow. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Lord and my Father, oh God, we pray tonight, oh God, that you bless your God, Father, our hands. Bless your God, Father, the works of our hands. That whatsoever we shall touch, oh God, that whatsoever we shall do, oh God, Father, shall bring, oh God, Father, shall heal, and God falls, oh Lord, in our lives and families, in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, your God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, my Father, because your spirit is in me, I shall actualize my dreams and vision in the name of Jesus. When the Spirit of God is upon you, there is nothing you cannot do. Philippians says, I can do all things. Do pray that strengthens me. I want you to pray tonight and prophesy upon your life that you are going to actualize your dreams. Whatsoever you have dreamed that you are going to do this thing, whatsoever you have thought about or you, or you have written down, this year 2021, that God will give you the grace to actualize them. Open your mouth and begin to pray. My Lord and my Father, oh God, we thank you, Lord King of Glory. We stand upon your word, oh God, Father, because you are a faithful God. We pray, Lord King of Kings, oh God, we shall actualize our dreams and vision. This year 2021, oh God, our dreams, oh God, shall never be cut short. But our vision shall never be cut short. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, oh God, the enemy, they will never overcome King of Glory still. Our dreams and vision away from us, oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Lord and my Father, we proclaim the word of God for God tonight. That oh God, King of Glory, our dreams and visions of God, Father, shall touch our lives, oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Say, my Father. My father, bring me to the path of greater heights. Throughout 2021, our team says, My year of greater heights. You are going to pray and confess it and believe it in your heart. And say, God, give me the strength 
given the power when the spirit of God works in you, you can do all things. You are going to ask God for the grace tonight, for a greater height, that God's spirit will dwell upon you, that God's spirit will push you to the greater height. Open your mouth and begin to pray. My Lord and my Father, oh God, we pray tonight, oh God, that King of glory, lead, lead us, oh God, Father, to the right path, oh God. Father of greater height, oh Lord. Father, lead us, oh God, Father, to the right path of greater height, oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. This year, oh God, Father, we will never go down, oh God. Father, this year, oh God, King of glory, we will never, oh God, Father, remain the same. Father, oh Lord, King of glory, your spirit shall move us forward, oh God, to that part of the foot of greater height. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to declare upon your life tonight. Say, I declare throughout 2021, I shall walk in the right in the right path. Putting the heart of God with my giving and helping the needy. With some of us who have been so stingy, we have not been able to give towards the work of God. We are going to pray tonight and say, God, this is my declaration this day. This is my commitment to you that I'm going to be faithful in my work with you. If you want the Holy Spirit of God to dwell in you, you must make a commitment. You must make your, your, part, your, your, your part right with God. You must give unto the work of God. You must build for the kingdom of God. You must help those that are needy. This is what God expects of you. Open your mouth and pray tonight. And say, Father, help me in the right path. Touching the heart. When you give, you are touching the heart of God. When you give to those that don't help, you are touching the heart of God. When you give to those that that are that, that are that, 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 that are suffering, you are touching the heart of God. When you go to the orphanage, those old age homes, you are touching the heart of God. When you give the orphans, you are touching the heart of God. The widows are widows. I want you to pray. This year, ask God to make you a different person. We don't want to remain the same. We want to be committed in the work of God. Father, help us, oh God. This is our heart desire. Father, oh God, for your excellent spirit, oh God. Father, when your spirit, oh God, Father, dwells in us, we will be able, oh God, Father, to be committed, oh God, totally unto you. In faithfulness, oh God, with our offering, with our tithe, oh God. My Lord and my Father, with, oh God, your work of helping, oh God, for the door that I need. Father, help us, oh God, this is our heart desire. In this year, 2021, in the mighty name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. I want, I want you to speak upon your life and say, I speak upon my life. Let the oil of excellence abide upon me, upon my head, for outstanding achievement. I want you to pray upon yourself and the oil of excellence spirit to dwell upon you, to abide in you, for you to be able to, to achieve things, for you to be outstanding in whatsoever you are doing this year. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray, O oh God, that you are not our head with oil. Father, King of glory, of outstanding, outstanding, O oh God, Father, in all our endeavors. In the name of Jesus. Father, O oh God, help us, O oh God, for we cannot do it without you, Lord. Father, we ask, O oh God, that you, O oh God, Father, we grant us, O oh God, Father, this is our request tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to say, we shall ascend at honesty and speaking the truth and being a blessing to our workplace, in our workplaces, businesses, and also in the hearts of God. Amen. This year, if you want to walk in the path of righteousness, you must be honest. You must prove yourself trustworthy before God. You must walk in the path of righteousness. This is some of us we tell lies, it doesn't move us. We are dishonest in our workplaces, in our, with our businesses, with, even in the hearts of God. We are going to pray and ask God to help us. We have decided to turn a new leaf. We have decided to walk in the path of righteousness with our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. So I want you to pray tonight and ask God, to help you to be that woman, that girl, that boy, 
that you, people will find you to be honest in all that you will do. Even in your place of work, open your mouth and pray tonight. My Lord and my Father, O oh God, we ask, O oh God, Father, for the spirit of honesty in our lives, O oh God, Father, in the place of our work, O oh Lord, in our places, O oh God, Father, King God, Lord, we do our businesses. My Lord and my Father, I pray that you will help us, O oh God, this year to be faithful unto you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I want to declare upon your life and say, I declare, I shall be preferred, I shall be approved, and favor throughout 2021. Daniel was preferred above others. I want you to prophesy upon your life and mention your name and say you shall be preferred. If you are, you are the one that is looking for a job, you will not have a job. You are going to ask God that wherever you go to submit your CV, you shall be preferred, you shall be approved, you shall be favored. Open your mouth and claim this in the name of Jesus. My Lord and my Father, we pray, O God, King of Glory, just as Daniel, O God, Father, was preferred, O God, among O God, Father, the midst of others. Father, we pray, O God, King of Glory, that we shall be preferred in the name of Jesus. Father, this year, 2021, O God, we shall be divinely favored, O God. My Lord and my Father, we shall be approved, O God. My Lord and my God, Father, whatsoever, O God, King of Glory, who have desired, O God, Father, shall be approved, O God, shall be granted, O God, Father, with your divine favor and mercy in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. You are going to say, My Father, I receive negativity in my life. In my life, in the name of Jesus. My Father, I refuse negativity in my life. This year, we must stop professing negative things. We must, re we must be positive in everything we do. You are going to open your mouth tonight and pray. And ask God to help you. Give me the grace to remain positive. No matter the challenges that the life may bring, that God will give you the grace to remain positive in whatever you are doing. Hallelujah. That God will give you the grace to remain positive. We shall not be the type of God first negative thing. Open your mouth and pray. I God to uphold you. I God to grant you the grace. I God to give you divine grace to remain positive throughout this year 2021. In everything you do, in your business, in your academics, in your ministry, that God will remove every negativity in our hearts. In the name of Jesus, my Lord and my Father, tonight, O God, we call upon your church of day. Ask, O God, Father, for the Spirit of God, Father, King of Glory, to be positive in all that we do, O Lord. Father, Lord, King of Glory, as Daniel walk over for thy righteousness with you. You never doubted your word, O God. Father, we pray that you, O God, Father, will help us, O God, to remain positive. Father, O God, destroy every spirit of negativity in our lives. Father, in our families, in the name of Jesus, even in our health, O God, in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We bless your name tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Finally, I don't know what your heart desire are. Wherever you are, I want you to open your mouth tonight and pray. Ask God. Lift up your hand. Ask God those things that you have desired this year 2021 or you have written down i want you to lift it up and commit them before the hand of god because this is our year of greater height the lord shall grant us our heart desires open your mouth and begin to pray our father lord king of Lord, we thank you we bless your name and your faith father oh god king of glory your children has written oh god father lord king of glory your heart desires before your throne of grace father we ask oh god Thou ancient of day, Papa King God, Lord, who again and answered our prayers, Father. You said we shall ask, we should ask of God, Father, in your name. That Lord King God, Lord, our sorrow we shall ask, shall be given unto us. Father, as your children are sweet in oh God, my Lord and my Father, we pray that you will answer us speedily in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, oh God, King God, glory. Father, we ask, oh Lord, as we our faces are different, oh God, so also. Father, our problems, 
our challenges are all low. Father, Lord, as many, Father, that have written, O oh God, Father, as many that have lifted up their prayer requests before your throne of grace. Father, I pray that you will read and answer us, Lord. Father, read and answer us, Lord. Father, I read and answer us, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, precious Father. Thank you, saints of day. Father, we thank you, O God, for answering our prayers for God tonight. Father, Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Today is our third day of the Lord Show Me Your Way. You continue with us. We'll come away and we'll come again tomorrow before you. We want you to stay tuned. This is Total Restoration Worship Center International. Where God is about doing good in your life. God bless you. Good night. Let's say the grace together. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely His goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life, and you shall dwell in the hands of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. I want you all say, that I shall not die, but please to declare the goodness of the Lord in the land of our living. Amen. You shall not die, but please to declare the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Amen. And we shall not die, but please to declare the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Amen. God bless you. Hi, and welcome to our service. If you're new here, you may be wondering who we are and what this church is all about. Well, the heart of the matter is this. We're a group of people doing our best to love God and love those around us. One of the ways we express this love is through worship because our God is truly amazing. He created everything, great and small, and His love for us is incredible, powerful, and completely unconditional. We also spend time looking into His Word, the Bible, and receive practical teaching to guide us along His path in our everyday lives. But it doesn't end when the service is over. Throughout the week, we gather in groups to serve, pray, reach out to our community, and sometimes just to hang out and have fun. Life is full of challenges, and none of us are perfect. But we believe that's one of the reasons God has brought us together. We're all here to help and support each other through each step of life's journey, because nobody should have to travel alone. So thanks for joining us today. No matter who you are, we want you to know you are welcome.